Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's my birthday. So I am just picking up a little footage from the actual day of my birthday. I just have opened this great gift that I got from Kofi and the kids, a new pair of tennis shoes that I'm going to use to walk to a lash appointment this morning and get my birthday started off um, on the right foot. Just gonna kind of take the morning to myself. That's my plan for today. This On this birthday, I am turning 39. It's a big, big birthday of finale to my, my 30s. And I think on Friday, Koki and I are planning to go out to dinner, so I will share what that was like. But it's just gonna be, you know, another day. It's a weekday. We're in the middle of this crazy election. Uh, Laya has art history today that I'm going to be teaching, and Lincoln has soccer practice. So, uh, easy morning, but, you know, also kind of normal rest of the day. Tennis shoes. Like <laughs> yes, yes. One of the benefits of these new tennis shoes is that it makes me a little taller. Makes you <laughs> I am on my way out. I'm gonna have to hustle it up. Um, walking to my last appointment. All right. so I'll be back. Thanks. So it's actually gonna be 92 today, which is crazy for November 5th. <laughs> um, but I guess I would rather have warmth and cold any day. So it's kind of nice and I'm able to walk to this. All right, so I just got my lashes done. I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but I thought they turned out great. And now I'm walking back home. I'm gonna take this off for a while because there's not too many people around me. All right, so I'm a little backlit, but I was just gonna say one thing that was really cool about the nail salon today is that it was also a staff person's birthday. So while I was lying there getting my lashes done, they started singing happy birthday and playing it over the uh, inner or the speaker system. So that was so cool. Um, good bit of serendipity for me. Uh, now I'm gonna go home. I think I'm gonna kind of make a post. As I was lying there, I was just thinking, I kind of wanna make a post for my birthday on my social media, obviously, as one always does. And just reflecting on what I wanna talk about this year, I actually was thinking I kinda of wanna talk about the support that I get and have gotten over my lifetime from the different men in my life. So obviously, at this point in my life, my you know top support comes from my husband, Kofi. He's more than a friend, he's really my mentor. I really consider him my mentor. Um, and then, of course, my dad, who has had such an important part of shaping me as a person um, and as an athlete. But there are all kinds of other people, you know, uh, that have shown support and kindness to me. And I think a lot of times it's interesting that women don't talk about that or acknowledge that, like the role of our male friends in our lives. And I have a cousin who's like a brother to me. He lived with me for several years and he is a major source of support in my life. I have two brother-in-laws that are very loving and supportive. Um, Kofi's best friend is the godfather to our children. He's also extremely supportive. I've just had different kinds of people that I've worked with professionally, even people that I coach with, um, who've been really supportive. All right, I'm about to cross the street. I'll continue on the other side of the street. All right, so I just had to cross the street. So safety first, don't wanna be talking while I'm uh, crossing. But I was just gonna say, uh, and then besides those uh, people, uh, people that I've coached with, even the current coach that I coach with, He's also a good friend and source of support and, uh, you know, professionally. Um, there are also just a bunch of people, uh, guys that I knew when I was in school, uh, high school and college, who were always kind, who were always protective, who were always encouraging, who were, um, you know, friendly competitors, uh, making me a better person intellectually. Um, so, I do obviously so much in the women's and girls' empowerment space. That was my scholarship in my 
doctoral program that I thought it would be really important to kind of balance out the perspective by acknowledging all the guys. So thanks, thanks. Thanks to all you guys out there who've been helpful in my process as well. I'm back, I'm back. How are things going? It smells like soup, it smells good in here. All right, so I'm just headed downstairs. We got back from soccer practice. You know, the day kind of went as expected. I um, ran a, an abbreviated art history class with Laya and her homeschool classmate. Made some Butter chili. Bottle. There he is, he's home now. Uh, made some chili that we're about to uh, eat. This chili looks so great. Let me show you about this chili, but. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear mommy. Happy birthday to you. So sweet. You should have had it ready to pop. Yes, so sweet. Right, so this is awesome. A vegan red velvet layer cake. Excellent, because I'm lactose intolerant. So that was very thoughtful. Thank you guys. Mm -hmm. Mandatory favorite sound for birthday for all celebrations. about to be officially official. You guys want some kitty champs? Yeah! All right, hang on. Let's grab that. Midnight, 12 midnight and 30 seconds. 
I got my first birthday, happy birthday present from Maya. Cody just told, told everyone. <laughs> Is that what he said? Is that what happened? Yeah, well, you should send them a message and then they were like, oh yeah, my um, Cody is on the group chat, so I don't remember. Like, <laughs> she sure did. Me up. No, but it was so funny because it was like literally. 1201. Yeah. Oh, Amaya stays up really late. She takes up really late. Oh, whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Wait, Mom, whoop. Wait, 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 Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you, everybody. Happy birthday, mommy. Cheers. Cheers. And Scott sent his birthday wishes. Thank you. I appreciate that from Scott. Oh, you might need to refill. You might need to refill. So I guess we move on to dinner, which is chili and cornbread. And then tomorrow we have dinner out. Happy birthday. Yeah, so that should be nice. Bye. 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 So welcome to Friday. We are kind of hectic here because we are doing a little bit of a minor redesign-ish in the living room area. I think just all of this time that I've spent in quarantine, I've decided there's some things that I want to change moving forward. So I actually just bought a full bar. I've got a new sideboard for over there. Um, I have a new coffee table and stool coming in. So the things are starting to trickle in now and now I have to do the work of removing what we have or swapping out what we have for our new piece. So hopefully that'll get done this weekend. So the new bar is in. I like it, I like it a lot. So part of this little transformation. It's just music on this comfort glass. All right, so it is dinner time. We are headed to go drop the kids off at their grandparents' house for an overnight, which will be cool for them. And then Koki and I are headed out to have uh, dinner. And then maybe tomorrow we'll have lunch all together to wrap up the birthday celebrations. <laughs> birthday dinner coming up. Coming up. excited about this. I appreciate doing this a lot. Mm -hmm. uh, it kind of gets me to uh, uh, experience and, and Kind of try new things and test in a cool climate area in Napa Valley. And what happens when you grow grapes in a cooler climate, you get wines with great acid. And what makes great wines with great acid is food. Food pairings with wines with high The acid. dinner was delicious. The wines were incredible. And it ended up being extra special because we got to have the dinner with our good friends, Stephen and Malia, uh, who we usually double date with. But because of COVID, we hadn't been out with them much this year. Hi. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Mimi. Happy birthday to you. I was excited about this gift of wines that I got from them from Black Owned Wineries. The next morning, Kofi and I got up and we went to go pick up the kids. Okay, so I'm ending up this birthday vlog with probably one of the best birthday presents of all, which is... Me! Hey! <laughs> Not just him, but Joe Biden has been named President-elect of the United States which is really just so fantastic. It means a lot to so many people. We are glad to be over this hump. We had a lovely dinner last night, a really good time. And now we're just headed to go pick up the kids and maybe do a little shopping with some of my birthday gift card money. So. Now she has to share. Bye. <laughs>